Every time I sit down to code, I can't help but think about the chaos that often ensues when we skip the structured guidelines. It's like stepping into a minefield without a map. You think you're safe, but one wrong step, and you're knee-deep in defects. Let's face it, the reality of coding without a solid foundation is frustrating. You start with a brilliant idea, but without clear guidelines, that idea quickly spirals into a tangled mess of bugs and miscommunication. I've been there, spending hours, sometimes days, fixing issues that could have been avoided if we had just laid out a proper plan from the get-go. Imagine this, you're working on a project with a team and everyone has their own interpretation of what the end product should look like. Without structured guidelines, you end up with a patchwork of code that doesn't mesh well. It's like trying to assemble a puzzle with pieces from different boxes. The result? A product that's not only late, but riddled with defects. And let's talk about quality assurance. It's not just a phase, it's a mindset. When we don't establish clear guidelines, we're essentially saying, let's wing it. But winging it leads to missed requirements, overlooked edge cases, and ultimately, a product that doesn't meet user expectations. I've seen teams scramble to fix issues during the QA phase, only to realize that the root cause was a lack of clarity in the initial stages. So what's the solution? It starts with creating a structured framework before any coding begins. This means defining roles, responsibilities, and expectations. It means having a clear set of guidelines that everyone can refer to. It's about establishing coding standards, documentation practices, and communication protocols. When we take the time to set these guidelines, we're not just preventing defects, we're fostering a culture of quality. We're empowering developers to make informed decisions and reducing the time spent on rework. It's about creating a shared vision that aligns the team and streamlines the development process. I know it sounds tedious, but investing that time up front pays off in the long run. It's like building a house on a solid foundation. You wouldn't dream of constructing a building without blueprints, so why do it with code? Let's shift our mindset from reactive to proactive. By implementing structured guidelines, we're not just avoiding pitfalls, we're paving the way for innovation. We can focus on what really matters, delivering high-quality software that meets user needs and stands the test of time. In the end, it's about taking responsibility for our craft. We owe it to ourselves and our users to ensure that the code we write is not just functional, but also reliable. So let's commit to structured guidelines and watch as our projects transform from chaotic endeavors into streamlined successes.